Hey guys, welcome back to my updated skincare routine. I'm going to leave my skincare routine from a few years ago linked down below for you guys, so go check that out um, after. I'm going to start off by using the St. Ives Apricot Scrub, and I'm going to apply this to my wet, to my dry face, sorry. And um, I use about like a nickel size, maybe even a quarter size sometimes, and I have a really nasty zit in the middle of my like eyebrows and one right above my lip. So I'm just picking up a little bit more and using that on the forehead and this moisture or this exfoliator is so great it's from the drugstore if you guys haven't used it I definitely recommend it I used to have little bumps on my arms like on my shoulders and I don't remember what it's called but it's some kind of like skin thing and my mom told me to use this and I did and I don't have any more little tiny bumps on my skin so they basically just look like you had goosebumps all the time so I use that every single day um, on my body and they were gone within a year. Um, I know that sounds like a long time, but I had had them for 15 years when I started doing that. So it was not, it was nothing to me um, when it was gone in a year. Uh, so I take a little bit of water after I put it on my dry face and massage it in and re-massage it to get it so setting up and really working at the dead skin that you want to remove. And once you're done using this, your skin feels like a baby's but literally you have such soft skin after you use this um, but this is a very harsh exfoliator so definitely only use this one to two times a week because if you use this every day your skin's gonna dry out because while it is moisturizing it does kind of dry out your skin a little tiny bit but it does more moisture than drying out but when you use that every single day you're gonna see more dryness than moisture um, on your skin so I definitely recommend to use this one to two times a day that's also what the bottle says um, if you want to do a light exfoliator in between like every day you can you're just gonna have to find one um, I do know of a couple but I'm not sure right off the hand what those are um, so I'm now taking my Ole Active Botanicals Gel Cleanser. This has uh, white mushroom extracts in it, and this was sent to me in an influencer box box, so I was very happy to try it because if I saw this at the store and read that there were mushroom extracts in it, I would not have purchased it because I hate mushrooms. But this doesn't smell anything like that, it just smells nice and clean. And you saw that it went from a clear gel formula to a sudsy, white, foamy kind of formula onto my skin. This moisturizes your skin so well. It gets rid of any impurities, any dirt. It really removes makeup really well. I have not used it for the eyes because I don't like anything that's soapy like this on my eyes, so I just use an oil for my eyes, but today I'm not using makeup, so this is just bare skin, um, but this will remove makeup, so this is a really great cleanser. It's very moisturizing. Again, by itself, your skin will feel like a baby's butt, but with the Saint Ives, exfoliator oh my god this is fabulous so I really recommend for you guys to pick it up I think it's five or six bucks again at the the drugstore it's it's such a great product um I don't know I'm just speechless about it it's really great I didn't think it was gonna be as good and again it's active ingredient or it's active it's natural ingredients just like the St. Ives as well now I'm going to just pat around my face um, to just soak up any extra moisture because I am going to go in with a moisturizer in a minute. Okay, so I'm just going to moisturize my lips with just this cheap lip balm. It's very buttery and I actually got it from Walmart for like a dollar when it was Christmas time. So it's like a ginger man, ginger man, gingerbread one. <laughs> Um, so now I'm taking the Puridor Organic Argan Moisturizer, Argan Oil Cream Moisturizer. I don't know exactly what it's called, um, and I'm just dotting that all over the face. I do add a little bit more to my forehead, but everywhere else that's all you need, and it's so great. Um, I'm still testing it out, but so far it's really helped the smoothness of my skin. It really provides a lot of moisture. It's not too thick, even if it is a cream, that it's not going to like like mess with your foundation. So it's great for underneath makeup. Um, I'll leave the link or the review to Puridor um, down below. I did a whole video on it, so I'll show you guys down below. Um, so now I'm going to take the Skin Nutrition. I believe that's what it's called. It's a uh, depuffer and it 
helps get rid of dark circles. I'm still testing this out. I just uploaded a Dollar Tree haul, so I'm going to go ahead and link that for you guys down below as well. Um, and I'm still testing it out, so there will be a review on these two products. The next one's coming. Um, so just so you guys know. And this one is in a green tube, and this helps to get rid of age spots, dark spots, and acne. So I'm just using it on my acne today to see if it'll go away. And then I kind of, this just defeats the purpose. I didn't even need to use it. I haven't tested that yet. So I'll tell you why it defeats the purpose here in a second. So now I'm taking this Josie Marin Argan Oil in the light formula and I'm taking five or six drops in my palm of my hands. I have to grab a few more drops for my forehead. And I'm really moisturizing my face today because um, I just want my skin to feel better. It just has been feeling really, really dry because of the winter time and the atmosphere that's going on outside. It's just terrible. It's really flaky around the nose, so I really wanted to add in some oil to help moisturize my skin. Now I'm going to take the Beauty Secrets Tea Tree Oil right there, and I'm going to put this over my acne, and this really helps get rid of my acne within one or two days when I use it, so that's why the green tube is just perfect, like pointless. Um, so... Yeah, that's pretty much it for my skincare routine. If you guys enjoyed it, please give it a huge thumbs up, and I'll see you guys in my next one.